this looks serious. Who's the client? Oh, let's have something new for a change, please. Do you know what this is about? No idea. Ah, oh, here we go. Good afternoon, everyone. Thanks for staying late. I appreciate it, short notice, but this is a big one. I knew it. I recognise one or two of you. Hi, Mia, Andre, <laughs> Elena. But for everyone else, I'm Laurie Baker, and I'll be running this project, which will be known as Project Florence from now on. I'm sure our client needs no introduction. It's Iliad Tracks. Yes. Hello, Tech, my old friend. It's been a while. Let's just say they've got themselves into a spot of trouble. <laughs> no kidding. Uh, they're a new client for us, so it goes without saying we'll all be bringing our A-game to this. Don't you worry about that. Every one of you is here for a reason. Mm. You've been selected for your particular skill set and experience. Finally in the right room. Or you're just available. <laughs> but seriously, Project Florence is going to be very high profile and very public. The media's all over it. There's government scrutiny. We're going to have to work very hard to get this done. Bring it now, on. I'm not going to sugarcoat this. It's going to be a tough gig. Okay. We simply don't have a big enough team. So we're going to need everyone to put in longer hours than usual. I'm in. And we're anticipating the project will last about six months. Fine by me. It will be high pressure. Chance to shine. But also, I'm sure, a very rewarding project and a great experience. <laughs> okay, Mia, don't mess this up. If you have any questions... No further questions. Come and wanna. speak to me afterwards or speak to your line manager. Uh, we'll go into the specifics of the team structure and planning with your individual department. Project Florence, here but I I'm come. But I'm more than happy to answer any more general questions now. Right, think of a question, Mia. Yes, Dominique. Look like you know what you're doing you and ask a good question. Well. That's a very good question. I'll get back to you on that one. Come on, let's get started. I need to make the 620. Mm. I can't miss another bedtime. Good afternoon, everyone. Thanks for staying late. I appreciate it short notice, but this is a big oh, one. Sorry, Sadie. It's just your mummy again TV. tonight. Hi, Mia, Andre, Hello. Elena. But for everyone else, I'm Laurie Baker, and I'll be running this project, which will be known as Project Florence from now on. Mm -hmm. I'm sure our client needs no introduction. It's Illutrax. Right. Okay. Let's just say they've got themselves into a spot of trouble. Better Google it. Now, they're a new client for us, so it goes without saying we'll all be bringing our A game to this. But every one of you is here today for a reason. Yeah. You've been selected for your particular skill set mm. and experience. Experience? Am I in the right room? Or you're just available. <laughs> oh, okay. That makes sense. But seriously, Project Florence is going to be very high profile and very public. The mm. media's all over it, there's government scrutiny. Go on. We're going to have to work very hard to get this done. Oh, no. Now, I'm not going to sugarcoat this. Uh oh. It's going to be a tough gig. We simply don't have a big enough team. Uh oh. So we're going to need everyone to put in longer hours than usual. Oh, no. And we're anticipating the project will last about six months. Six months? It will be. Say it'll be walking by the time also, I see I'm it. I'm sure next. a very rewarding project and <sighs> a great experience. I can't believe the time and Sarah's going to kill me. Do you have any me. questions? So Come many speak questions. Speak to me afterwards or speak to your line manager. We'll go into the specifics of... Should I say something now? With your individual I don't look stupid. But I'm more than happy That's to answer an opportunity, any Andre. more general questions now. I'm so sorry, Sarah. Uh, yes, Dominique. Will it be <laughs> this will be a tough conversation. Interesting tonight. choice of words. Question, I'll get back to you on that one. So, Mia, this is an opportunity for me to find out how you've been getting on with Project Florence. Great. I'm loving the work. I just hope that my experience has been of some use. Interesting choice of words. Some use? Well, I wish I could do more, but I don't have enough experience in business recovery. Well, we don't expect you to be an expert on everything. Your tech sector experience has been invaluable. <sighs> well, thank you. Hi, Andre. Good to see you. So, how is Project Florence treating you? Good. Really good. It's great working for a tech client. I've learned so much already. Well, that's good to hear. Mm -hmm. And what do you think your greatest contribution has been so far? Honestly, coming from a people and organisation team has really helped make Neither of us are mentioning the elephant in the room. aware of the impact on Illutrax's employees and how to handle that sensitively. Now, how are you finding the hours? I think I'm coping really well, actually. Uh-oh. <laughs> when you say coping... Well, I mean, I'm on top of it. You know, I actually think that I enjoy the stress. <sighs> that doesn't sound good. Mia... 
You know that it's perfectly okay to speak out if you're finding the workload too much. Too much? No. No, no. Honestly, I'm fine. Honestly? What have been the more difficult aspects you've had to address? Oh, just say it, well, Laurie. Well, my lack of experience okay, in the enough. sector has... Listen, Andre, before we carry on, I'd really like to apologise. Apologise? Yes, apologise. I should have realised that with your new baby, this workload, these hours, were going to be much harder on you than the rest of the team. No, no, it's, it's absolutely fine, honestly. It's not fine, Andre, and that's my fault. I'm so wrapped up in my own work, but I missed some details. I'm just sorry we didn't address it sooner. <sighs> Thank you, Laurie, I really appreciate that. Feels good to get it out in the open. <laughs> you know, this reminds me of my first big project. I thought I could do everything, but you have to let go and trust your team to do their jobs. If you don't, well, everyone suffers. Your team, your client, you. Well, you see, I, um... Oh, it doesn't matter. I bet it does. No, go on. Well, I think I've got a lot to offer Project Florence. It's just that I'm not always able to do my best work. Now we're getting somewhere. Because, well, I love advising the team on the tech space. And I'm really pleased that I was asked to do it, but, but I feel like I'm taking on too much of their work. And I know everyone's up to their necks in it, and, and I don't want to let anybody down. You're not letting anyone down by asking for help. I know we're short staff, so if you need more support, you need to tell me. In all honesty, I could use some more support. That would be amazing. Well, leave it with me. We'll see what we can do. Thanks, Laurie. I feel so much better already. <laughs> And how is Sadie? She's great. Really great. This, this remote working has really made a difference. I get to see her so much more now. Little things. Bath time, bedtime. Great. Well, keep me in the loop on the remote working. We want to make this work for everyone, including you and the little one. Thank you, Laurie. I appreciate it. You're very welcome. I suppose we should get back to work? Absolutely.